Hey, what's going on, everybody? Blaze it here, coming at you with another Naruto Shinobi Collection video. All right, this time we're gonna be going over the uh, massive maintenance update and uh, telling you guys what's been going on in the game uh, since uh, it dropped. Um, it finished maintenance about um, what was it, about five hours ago now, probably a little bit longer. And um, the maintenance put out a major thing for the potential system, allowing us to click this. For 150,000, I can finish the entire first page and be done with it. I don't have to sit here and click each individual node. That's something Dokkan has imp implemented yet. You can just click all of it and be done with it, except for when you absolutely need to make a decision. Other than that, you just click this button right here and boom, hit the green one. And it will open up all the um, potential nodes for you and uh, be done with it. That's actually very powerful, very awesome. Um, I do like that. Um, I don't know if I want to do it for this Naruto, though. I'm tempted to do it. Let me see something. How many days do I have until all the key missions are gone? I have a day and 13 hours. So if I come home later tonight and grind like crazy, I could finish that up and be done with it. So I can um, replace the keys I lost max potentially Naruto. And then um, that could be another max potential unit I have. All right, that's perfect. So that's probably what I'm going to do then. Just to have another max potential unit out there running around. Um, I don't have enough for um, for uh, pain right now. And I don't know if I still want to do pain because the new month is coming out. I got 216 gems. Um, the shop is going to refresh tomorrow and allow me to get um, another 45. So that'll be over 250 gems I have. Plus the missions and plus other stuff coming out. So I'll be able to have a first five rotations on that banner. And hopefully I'll be able to get the new god unit. Um, Naruto is right there. So I guess I'll pop open Naruto. I do use him, especially if I'm going up against Akatsuki units in order to, um, Jutsu seal the entire team and be done with it there. But there are times where I've run into a situation where they didn't get Jutsu sealed. Um, uh, what is this? Um, I probably should just put the Leaf Edge metal on them and call it a day. Let's see, see something. Let's just throw that on him for right now. And then I'll come back with the Leaf Village Metal maybe later and be done with it. So that's probably what I'm going to do right there. Going up against the Katskis. He's going to be... He's best used in 3v3 because you can actually see who he's fighting up against. So let's actually hit this potential node right here. And let's see how far we can get. Before I got to go trade for some stuff. Oh, that is so awesome. That is so beautiful. Thank the Lord Jesus Christ. Oh my gosh, do you know how fast I can potential some stuff now? Oh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you so much. Now watch this. I can click an ability. So I have between HP 2,000, defense 1,000, attack 1,500. And I think that's dodge rate or dodge chance. So I usually just go with the HP. So let's go over here and hit this. Let's hit this one. You also see all the stuff you can hit. Boom, for 300,000. Boom, page done. Hit the middle button, boom. So if you built up a lot of potential for your units, you can finish this shit quick. Watch this, boom. Oh my God, that is so much faster. Thank you, Lord. Oh, whoever told Gree to do that is a genius. I appreciate it. Give that skill damage to him. Then uh, give him the skill damage right here. Give him the skill damage right here. And then give him the skill damage right hither. All right, come back over here. Hit that center button. Hurry up, hurry up. All right, boom. Now let's see. We got the HP. Give him that. HP, give him that. Like I said, it only works when you have to make a decision. As long as you don't have to make a decision, it's clicking it for you. That's amazing. Dokkan needs to put that shit into the game. Unless you want to choose between crits or additionals or dodge rate or whatever, that's what it needs to put into the game. I'm tired of having to click all this stuff. It's really fucking irritating. Um, what should I click? Right, I'm going to come back for that later. Open that up. Cause I got like 17 of these cause I never really potential my um, 40 cost units. I'm mostly focused on my God leads. I should start focusing on my, um, my lesser units. Look at that. Look at all the arrows fly up on the right side. That's so cool. Here, let's watch this one. Open this one up. 
I probably won't be able to get this one though. Oh no, I got everything on this one too. Let's see. Oh, that is so fucking awesome. Whoever idea this was agree they need to do it. I need them to do my final idea though. I need them to do this. I need them to finally implement um Bam, baby. Oh, that is so cool. We finished out a character quick as hell. And I got enough in the shop, too, where I can just go uh, trade for this stuff and get the fist and stuff and be done with it. Oh, that is so awesome. Um, they need to implement my thing at Gree, where I said um, I need these people to um, go on ahead and put all the repeat in the game. That's the next big quality in life update I need them to put into the game. I need them to put into the game... Um, What's the name of uh, the, the, the auto repeat? I just said it. How did I forget it? I need them to put auto repeat into the game like they have a grand cross. If they put that into the game, my grinding will be um, increased significantly because I want to click each individual thing anymore. Put more quality of life in these gotcha games. Um, let me click uh, HP. And then I need to click that and I need to think of one for that one i'll think about it when i get done with it so i'm already on the last page this is the last page right here just these three fists and these four right here and then i need to choose an ability to pick so i'm going to go back and look at what the options are again before i pick and then i'll be done with this so that narcho is pretty much done i was going to grab a couple of things and i'll be done with him so let's back out again because i want to talk about real quickly we got some files put into the um so I got some data put into the files, I should say it that way, of uh, the new game mode, uh, Ninja Tactics, that's supposed to be coming out uh, tomorrow. So, the homie Yuya came again with leaks, and um, what's it say so far? We have, as expected, we have only have only six playable characters as of right now. Okay, and also tweeting this out will give you 10 stones. So let me grab my 10 stones real quick. Tweet. Your tweet has been sent. That's perfect. All right, so back to this. All right, so this game most dropping tomorrow. It's going to be here for an entire month. And um, as expected, it looks like there's only six playable characters. Hmm. I can't wait to see it is because he has a bunch of files and stuff too. He has tactics area, the attribute, the battle condition, the battle result, battle UI, the profile, the command, the in-game mission, place, resident menu, big, scene, Scene, I can see BG. That was that scene background. I guess that's what it means. Skill info, status, sub deck. All right, so that's pretty cool right there. Also, there's a big ass batch download tonight. This is kind of empty. All right, so there's gonna be another big batch download tonight. So, uh, get ready for that. So, they've only downloaded a major part of it today, and then they're gonna download another major part of it later on before the um actual um game mode drops. So we learned we got some bad news from the homie Yuya. It says um, there's going to be most likely a gotcha mechanic in the future. So there possibly may be a gotcha mechanic in the future. There may possibly be some units that will come out in the future that we have to summon for. That may be exclusively good for the new mode. So get ready for that. The only thing that gotcha do is new units with additional effects for tactics. Okay. So they're, hopefully if they do release units that are good for tactics, they just have an additionals or something built into their abilities that are good for tactics, but they also work in other areas of the game. Please don't have it to where they just only work in tactics. Um, that's going to be fucking irritating. So other than that, let's see what else we have. We have HP, MP, attack, defense, move, crit, and this should be nice. So we don't know what the MP means yet, though, because they have something on here that says uh, MP, uh, HP. Usually MP is like fucking mana points or something like in um in like Final Fantasy or something. But um in, in this case, I have no idea what MP would stand for. Um, three three defaults can be changed. The only default unit itself is say leveling mechanic to gain new skills. So you can gain new skills by doing this. Just looking at the data, there's attack for skill learning. So it's possible for you to learn new skills in this game when you take your tactics units into it. That's actually pretty freaking interesting. Um, this is the other one right here that tells you you can get 30 stones from it. Okay. And then um, I think the video they did show has some level of confidence. So that's going to be interesting right there. Um... Okay, for example, Naruto is a default skill that can be changed uh, for Rasengan, a buff, and sexy jutsu. So you can change around people's jutsu to give you uh, different effects and stuff with your skills. And we can actually use sexy jutsu on people. I don't know what the sexy jutsu would do. I guess it would just charm you and you wouldn't attack Naruto. 
and it's fixed like a passive okay it's an alpha at the moment too so it's not gonna be um anything um major right now but i am interested to see what this is gonna look like in the future what updates and things they could do to change this i could see this being very hype and this is coming out right before anniversary too so that's actually very interesting because anniversary will start getting information on anniversary right when this ninja tactics ends so they'll have a month to take in um information for about uh tactics and then um they could turn around release anniversary and probably some new updates for tactics hopefully like i said auto repeat auto repeat auto repeat that's the biggest update i want them to come to the game i've been saying that for months now i want auto repeat into the game let's see so we're gonna get some more units coming out later tonight so get ready for that more units will be dropping and um more data will be dropping as well for this um massive new game mode like i said i'm not a big tactics guy but hopefully this will be interesting and hopefully it'll get me into it um but other than that that's it for this video right here guys the kizuna units have also come back i don't feel like torturing myself to see if i can get them i think i'm good I, I, i'm just gonna let them come to me fuck it if i don't get the kizuna sasuke and tachi then fuck it I, I think i'm done with this arc i don't i just don't feel it i ain't feeling like i'm gonna get them i don't feel it last time they came back it was at 10 percent. now they're back at if you do 10 multis it's a 25 percent chance to pull them but watch my dumb ass pull them and only get uh get the stupid units at the bottom I just feel it. I don't feel like I'm going to pull them. I don't feel like wasting the stones, especially when I know another god or god slayer is going to come out in the beginning of the month. And um, I'm going to turn around and be looking stupid. I don't know what unit's going to be coming out in the month that's going to be OP for a god. But um, what, haven't, what god haven't we had in a while? We haven't had a god Sasuke in a while. So I guess that could be interesting. We could have a god Sasuke. What other god you going to have when we had in a while? Cause they can do anything now they've just released the new god sakura and god hinata so what god could they do that would actually sell pretty well would you guys be interested in a god neji let me know in the comment section below a god neji uh we have a god gara another god orochimaru he'll probably be a god slayer but i mean he could be a god what else haven't they released in a while since they have um rights to the last characters that what they could do is give us another i think could give us a god um the naruto from the last that would be actually pretty fucking fire because we don't have one at all we have um wandering shinobi sasuke who's a 90 cost unit but we don't have a naruto from that era so we could actually make him a god and then that naruto and sasuke would actually probably work well together and especially since that sasuke just got a buff with his potential system but um that's gonna be really hype right there that, i hope they do that but um, that's going to be it for this video right here, guys. You guys like this video? You want to see more? Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. All that bullshit. This me, your boy Blazehood. Peace out.